This is our Castico shower project, and Castico currently does not offer any shelves in their showers, so I have come up with my own solution. These are the shelves that you can purchase from another company very similar to Castco. I believe they sell an inferior product as far as their showers go, but they sell the color matched shelves. Now these come in all different colors, so we selected a few, ordered them, and this one matches really well um, to our Castico shower. So this is what you get in the box. You get this bracket, some screws, and then the actual shelf, which I believe is made just out of PVC. And it's a pretty simple installation. I'm going to take you through it today. So sit back and enjoy. So this is the bracket that they send you. Uh, pretty unique, but it also makes installation, I think, easier. It's already got the holes pre-drilled. So what I'm using is this drill with an offset um, attachment on it. Eighth inch bit, pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Now I've already established the height that I want um, roughly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put it in the corner where it belongs and I'm gonna fold this open. I'll put the link in the description below, by the way, where you can buy this kit. So I've just made a little mark right there. I'm going to take the kit back out, or the bracket, I should say. And set it down. I'm going to finish my drill. All right, so I've got my hole drilled. I'm going to go ahead and put one of these fasteners in. go I just barely snugged it now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my little bubble level which sticks on there conveniently and I'm gonna adjust until that's nice and level something like that now I'm gonna drill my other holes here Okay, now we fold this closed, and right there is about where it's going to sit. So, what they tell you to do now is to fold this, fold this around. It's soft enough that I can do it just with my hands, something like that. Oddly enough, they did not send me a screw for that hole, so I'm not really sure what that hole's for. But either way, that locks that in pretty nicely. I don't think they'll ever have a problem with it. All right, so for our sealant, I'm choosing Lexel Clear. Um, but I am going to use another type of sealant as well. I'm going to cut a relatively small bead on this to start with. That's about right for me. So, all right, let's get going. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little bit right here on this face. All the way across the front. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the bottom. Just on this face. Just like so. That's good. Not all the way to the corners. Now I'm actually going to put the rest of my sealant inside here. That way it doesn't smush up against my wall because I'm going to use a different type of um, use a different type of sealant up there. Uh, don't need much. All right, so what the trick to this is, is you want to open this up as much as you can. Something like that. And 
something down here. a little bit of squeeze out that's not the end of the world underneath barely a little squeeze out just push it in firmly there we are all right for this I'm using clean seal from Sashco this is a mold resistant sealant and it is wonderful wonderful stuff it's actually got active enzymes in it to prevent mold growth. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, these uh, shelves I think turned out really nice. We did opt to go with the white ones instead of the other colored ones just because the white was a little bit different tinge. So we went with the white shelves and we think it was a good decision. The client likes it. So if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment down below. I really appreciate that. Look forward to the next one. More Castico showers coming very soon.